Well, we here on Westside Grocery here on site, getting a chance to talk to the, the legend himself, yeah. Mr. Fred Vaughn. Mr. Vaughn, I know this was one of those days that just um, a historical day for you, as well as the city of Camden as well. This is one of these, you know, it's always something about neighborhood stores, a corner store. And mm. you have been around for over 59 years mm. consistently. And you got to think, we talk about 59 years through all of the pandemics, um, other stores closing down, yeah. um, all kind of types of yeah. things that we have faced. And yeah. you're still rolling. What, how has this, how have you sustained this for so long? Hard to tell. It just... One of those things that happened, uh, uh, unexplainable, you know. I don't understand, very unexplainable, but you know, a lot of people don't understand the, the hard work, uh, the blood, sweat, and tears you put in, not only just being a business owner for so long, a consistent uh, right. business owner. What would you tell to any young young person that want to start their own business? What would you tell them to make you successful? What would, they, what would you tell them to do? Be there. That's, it's the, one, that's, that's one of the dead rocks. In the, you know, what you're just being on hand every day. Uh, other than that, uh, be willing to work. You know. And you said a key word: the word "work." <laughs> we know this generation is so tough. Of we're talking about work ethic, and to be here um, right at 59 years, okay. and we know it's a lot of days that you didn't want to get up. <laughs> A lot of days you didn't want to open up these doors, but you knew it was somebody that you had to take care of, not only yourself, but you was taking care yeah. of other people, community, especially kids. Um, and we're talking about 59 years. That's, that's actually older than I am. <laughs> but guess what I did yeah. do? Years ago, I did eat a lot of candy from this store. Yeah. A lot of kids, I didn't yeah. stay on this side of time. My grandmother stayed a couple of blocks from this store. So I got an um, a opportunity to, to eat some of your product here. Um, that's why I got this big pooch right, right here. Right. And so I'm gonna blame you for that. Okay. Is that okay? Right. That's okay. Hey, but you know that's that's the great thing, and, I, and I'll tell you, um, God has tremendously blessed you and blessed us yeah, to yeah. have you around for this um, this long period of time, and God will mm -hmm. continue blessing you and doing things um, more. It's, it's so much more in store for you. You were like said, well, I, I'm, I'm I'm at a certain age now, but God has so much more in store for you here in the city of Camden. Mm -hmm. Many times you could have gave up, many times you could have used disability and a lot of things to just shut down and throw in the towel. But guess what? You said work being here because you had some things to take care of and you have done just that. And mm -hmm. I am so much honored and to be able to sit beside somebody that loves to work as well and you have put work ethics in us as well. And family means a lot too, you know. Have a strong family behind you, you know. And that's the big right. thing, family. And you say, you know, you, that the word family. A lot of people that the word family means so much to um, to you. Um, being able to make sure everything is in place, making sure right. the doors are open, even when you didn't right. feel right. good, right. you were still had hey, a rocking and right. rolling, right. dependable family. There you, go. Um, you know, okay. we all have some family, but you say you had a dependable family For that sure. you give kudos to. So exactly. we want to really thank you, you as well as your family yeah. for making all this possible and giving the city of Camden so much to look forward to and giving those these young people here and saying if you work at it you be there you be dependable and you have a hard strong family this is the result the thing I like to talk about more than anything else is the baseball team what what you know about some baseball our baseball team what you know about baseball? Well, all I know is that we were, had a successful team. We had people look at We got somebody uh, on, uh, what is it, Henderson's Hall of Fame? Yeah. yeah. So, so you but telling played me. played baseball on our team. So guess what you just did? I'm, I'm a really, sportsman. I'm, really, I'm really proud of that. I'm a sportsman. You a sportsman. It seems like that. Now you're opening up a whole other can of words. So guess what I got to do? I'm going to have to come back. And we're going to sit down and talk some baseball. Baseball in the gym. <laughs> and, and I tell you, I, you know what? My favorite sport is baseball. And you just mess, you'll mess me up. 
You just messed this whole it, it, thing it up. Started something, man. You done started something. Yeah. So tell me, tell me a little bit about the Hall of Fame baseball. Just tell me a little well, bit. I, I, I don't know. Any, I don't know anything specifically. You know, but you know what they've done other than just general information. You know. Yeah. But uh, it it was just. A, I just proud to work with them. You know, uh, they they worked so hard, and uh, at times uh, when it was difficult, you know, and and uh, look at them now. <laughs> Hey, yeah, they, 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 they did quite well, you know. Got looked at by Major League Scouts. Several of them. Well, and the great thing about it, what you say in baseball, we have a young man here at Camden. Um, he's a senior this year in high school at Camden Fairview High School. He is the number one outfielder in the state. Mm -hmm. And he's on the draft board, way up there in the draft board. So he might be going to the MLB. I got to get. You see, people, he, he, people like Billy Ray Cook. That's that uh -huh. quarterback. If he was living, he really needed. They say he he needed the credit, like credit, more credit than than I'm getting. Yeah, because uh -huh. Billy Ray was, uh, you know, you know, it was just hard to describe, you know, what he did, you know, and uh, how wonderful he was, you know. And the kids looked up to him. Look, I'm gonna have to get this young man to come out and see you and get some signatures, hey, because you know what, we're gonna sit down more. We're going to get you out of this. We're going to let you enjoy the rest of your day, the fame and the glory. Because guess what? You still got to go to work. Right. You got work right. to do. And mm -hmm. guess what? We're going to sit down pretty soon and talk some baseball. Okay. Just a okay. little bit in general baseball stuff. Okay. And I want to uh, thank you again. Appreciate you from Young Live Studios uh, Media. We enjoy. We, we, we thank you. We love you for what you have done for the city of Camden. Not only for the city of Camden, for people around the world. Okay. And good luck to you. And okay. continue working hard. Okay. Thank you.